Hey everybody, Asher here, back with more Inside, where we're continuing where we left off, and after a bit of figuring things for a while, we're just going to go and try and tackle this puzzle again now. What we have going on here is, and I just want to go ahead and just do this up front, just to reiterate from last time, right now we have something connected to our head and we have a little box that wants to fly up. We're trying to save some of the husk people. There's a lot of different words for them. What got me stuck before was that I was trying to move this box around back and forth. Like if you try and pull this up with the box on it, like this, the little engine, the little steam, whatever comes out of it, is just not strong enough. Well, I wasn't thinking about, I was thinking about things in a little bit more of a static sense instead of having to uh, play the rhythm game here because what you gotta do to actually open this up is to move the little box under here. And boop, we stopped it. No alarm bells or anything like that. We climb up and problem solved. It took me way too long <laughs> to figure this out. And as we get later in the game, I get... Oh, crap. Well, we got another person with a hard hat. At least he could survive the fall. But we got more buddies. So that's good. Two people with hard hats, even. So everyone can just mosey on along here. So as we are continuing our trek under the water, we have all kinds of goodies. Let's just go ahead and get our folks back over here. And it's a party! Now how many people does that give us? Because I looked back at the last video and I saw that I actually missed somebody. So we gotta go up anyway. Alright, let's go ahead and just go to the middle floor. It's funny how these guys aren't so creepy now, that it's just like, you know what, you're not actually trying to eat me, maybe we could be friends. Okay, it's a little creepy, it's like they get, they knock down and run into each other. A happy little elevator ding is always good. So let's go back over here. I did act a little bit too soon. And this is one of the first things that I saw and I landed in this room. I can't believe I forgot about it. We have our little red light observation deck over here. So if somebody's watching us or something. No words, no time to explain. But as we run over here. So there's one more person. I, I can't really do a head count. Alright. Is there something else in there? Oh, there is! Okay. So we got one other person, and... Okay, can I make that jump? Oh. Nope. Okay. Let's see. I could have these guys throw me up. Like, they'll throw me this way. Well, kind of. In theory. Will they throw me, like, over here? Whoop! Got it! Alright. Let's get you folks... Wait a minute. That's not gonna work. That worked! Okay. Momentum is fun. And look, we actually made that just fine. So we got people back here. That's all well and good. Let's see. How many do we have? And is there anywhere else that I might have missed people? It's just like, there's there's an interesting amount of backtracking. I wouldn't call it annoying backtracking, but I am a little curious here. Is that there's something shaking behind that big door. I wonder if like something's going to come in and just like crush and I have to run the other way. That doesn't seem great. Oh, wait a minute. There's somebody in the front here. I think he's not wearing pants. Who forgot to bring pants to the zombie apocalypse work site? So let's see here. 10982121. We're missing one. Of course we're missing one. I maybe I don't want to go into the room where things are trying to kill me all the time, but here we are. Well, I know I got stuff from up. I know I got stuff from down. There's only one dead end left that I haven't 
explored, and maybe I just was incorrect with my assumption there. So let's go this way. Come on, construction crew and pantsless wonders. All right. Can we get me? No. Oh, catch. Just throw me that way. There we go. Good. That's good combined platforming, and here's one more person. He's not coming. Okay, can we look out the window and see what's out there? Can you tell me? Okay, that's not good. Okay. Oh. Okay. I hope that counts. As if this game wasn't morbid enough. We even have dead zombies. But look, these guys caught me. How wonderful. So, let's see if that one counts or if I'm just missing something. Alright. many people they're all standing on the platform we need two one of those is me somehow all right the doors are open are those stars outside no it's something else what is this place oh shit no my zombie army I was counting on you like some weapon testing field or something? Okay, we can't climb over that. Let's just push it and see. Okay, we're waiting. Whoa! Um, let's just run, I guess, and... Nope! Holy cow! Did my head just get, like, obliterated? Okay. New plan! Let's not get caught out. Alright. Wait. And we run. There's no run button because it's all running. And. Okay, good. So. I'm hoping that switch does something good for me. Let's wait and see. When does the shockwave come? It's really nice to have those little things there. So I don't know what they're firing on. Alright. Oh, okay, so that knocked that one back down. Uh, no, let's wait. Run, child. I mean, that's some really fast action here. Yet you'd expect to see some of those move a little bit more before the other one. But yeah, interesting how he's walking a little more hunched around now. Like he's getting a little more zombified as we play. I hope that's not what they do to him. I kind of, I kind of like the everyman little child. All right. So let's see. What does this switch do? Okay, it stops everything. All right. Oh, so that's gonna block it. Okay. Okay, I know what we need to do. Because if I just jump up on the ladder, I die, but I need to, uh... Let's see here. Let's just stop it like this. And then we start. So, let's see if the next time the shockwave comes through, that's where it is. Okay, so... How are these timed? Okay, that didn't really work out too well. So it's pretty consistent down there and up there. Okay, so let's... We're a little bit... This is like Kerbal Space Program level stuff. Now we're a little bit ahead on our uh, orbital period. So let's wait for the next shockwave. Alright. 
like you can see all the gears and stuff so we're still there question is that do I need to stop it a little further up the ladder or a little further down Maybe we need to stop it way up there so next shockwave all right it's because there's that little bit of delay the ladder and I'm part way up I think I'm about to die okay good we got that one oh oh good I was about to say I'm not gonna make it on the ladder that long so we need to be down there on the next one that's that's really convenient that it's two shockwaves per orbital period right, and save me good run Oh my god, run. Okay, that's good. Oh boy. This is another timing puzzle, isn't it? So how high will this one go? Okay, so we would have died on it. Okay, that takes us up a little bit. I guess we just need to trigger it in time for the uh, next shockwave. Which means we need to count it out, don't we? There we go. And we're just jumping. Okay, we're in shelter and... Oh good! That's over. What's... Okay. Why are there a bunch of crash test dummy looking things? First off... We have zombie dudes. Why do we need crash test people? Well, we don't want to call them zombies. That's not very nice. I guess we have to flick the switch. Oh, okay. Let's just open the door in our uh, weapon firing range, shall we? That's lovely. Door on a track. Track. Door on a track. Door on a track. Door on a track. There we go. That worked out. Okay, so what is this? Okay, that's already timed. So I didn't get a clear look at where we need to be. How close to that ridge? Like to the left of it. Okay. I mean, what kind of what kind of screwed up stuff is this? Are they just testing weaponry or something, or is it just like? Okay. Oh god, we're gonna get smashed here. Yeah, I missed time that jump. start? Do we go all the way? Okay, so we're right here. Okay, so down over here. And how long do we have? I guess it's just some trial and error, isn't it? I guess it's not that much trial and error. We just run like hell, get behind pipes. Okay. So we're inside again. Whew. Please don't put me back outside with the, uh, I don't know, I don't know what you call that weapon, but it seems like, it seems like a weapon for a war that's already been fought and lost. Great, another elevator. And a steam pump. That we can't reach. We're about to be eaten by sea creatures again, aren't we? going down. We could have taken the stairs, but no, we're going to take the service elevator. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no, we landed in the water again. 
not to drown. Why haven't we drowned yet? There we go. There we go. All right, we gotta figure out how to get out of this cage and not die. What an uplifting game! Okay. Where's the exit? Top's not out. Floor's not out. The floor's lava. God, that's gonna take so much more physical exertion. Go to the light. One cough, two cough. You made it. Okay. Okay, so another wall. You're really close to dying right there too, aren't we? And what do we got here? Just a switch? It's never just a switch. Okay, didn't think so. And we got a little bit of time from the looks of it. There we go. Good old momentum. Okay, that office door looks like the lights are on. So I don't understand. I just don't understand this place. And I don't like going back in the water, guys. Seriously. Oh god, you're making me swim under again. Alright. So be it. Let's see. So if there's a button up there, and please tell me it's not going to be a button that floods this whole place with water. Chances are what we need to do is if we're going to get on a little platform right there, to get on a little platform right here, because I have a feeling this is not going to go high enough for me to jump. That'd be too easy. Okay, consider it too easy. No! No, no, no. I mean, she's attached to something, but no way. No, 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 no. We're not, we're not doing this. Okay, so that only goes a little bit. We don't have our little light thing here. I told you, I knew that that horrible siren, mermaid, whatever you want to call it, is uh, is too good to not use. So let's go ahead and just get our introductions in order. Let's see if they'll actually get us. Um, that was not what I expected that button to do. Oh, I get it. Okay. Okay. All right. We don't need to do that yet. Or I guess we do. Because we need to hit that button in time, so. Oh, come on. I missed time that so bad. Ugh! <laughs> Too soon, Executus. Alright. Some of you really don't get that reference. There we go. So easy. Now let's not get murdered by something with long hair, longer legs, and a penchant for biting. Maybe they're not all murderous. Maybe some of them just want to be set free. Maybe they're just a little bit hungry. Okay. I'm about to nope right out of this game. You're making me swim in there with her? Seriously? Okay, here goes. Hi. 
I know you're attached to something. I know the next puzzle probably involves you getting detached. Okay, does looking at her change things? Hi. Oh, how sweet. I always wanted a girlfriend that was going to strangle me under the water. All right, let's try that again. For some reason, it's like I know it's coming. My, I still get the automatic chill reaction. It's no different than water dogs after all. I wasn't wrong with my first instinct. They just are sexy water dogs. Okay, up we go. All right. Where the hell are we swinging? We're not swinging at all. Swinging a little bit. Okay, so is she not waiting underneath? Does she have friends? There she is. All right. Yeah, like I said, the concept of that is just too good to just use once and that's it. So yeah, here we are. Get the hell away from that water. Oh god, we have to go back in the water. Oh shit. Alright, well, I see a door down there. Good building design, guys. Here goes nothing. Here she comes. Get to the surface. She is an expert swimmer. Alright. Where is she going? Oh god, we're still doing this? Can't I just go on that platform over there? All right. See where the next place is. I can probably not die. Here she comes. Doggy paddle, doggy paddle. Okay, so she just keeps running back to where she is. So she's tethered to something some way, shape, or form. And I have a feeling that button's going to flood the rest of the whole area. So let's just get this out of the way. Can we jump onto that platform? Nope. All right, how would you like to have an area flooded and get mermaids after you? Um, oh no, this might be infinitely worse. Okay, please have like a stopping mechanism and don't just drop me back in the water, thank you. Okay, we're trying to hook onto something apparently. Yeah, I get some good swing in action here. I get down at the fulcrum though. This may not at all be the correct thing to do. But I feel like this is going to lead to some kind of secret. Or maybe I'm going to need this later. Well, we know it's here. Damn it, back to the water. All right. Please don't kill me too badly. Oh, she got me. Oh, wait a minute. Okay. So we can very clearly swim all the way over here just fine. We very much cannot swim straight up diving. But if we can get our swing on and throw ourselves just far enough, we're going to need all of our momentum though. Okay, we need to uh, get this going a little better than we are right now. There we go. There we go. There we go. And whoosh. Ah, it's not going to be enough. Didn't even get the button that time. All right. Seriously, you need to eat something. All right. Like, she's just lying in wait. I mean, the hook has got to do something here. 
the hook is the key. I could always just try to not suck at swimming. Let's try that. Oh, we suck at swimming. Fight for your life! Nope. Oh, well, if we're stuck again, I guess we're gonna be stuck again in just a second. Is there any other place in here that may have a clue? Like I said, the only thing that we have right now is a hook. And we have someone who's a very good deep water swimmer. Hmm. I don't think this is going to work because she's currently waiting, like, right there. But let's see if we try and rope it up like we did with the dog before. Let's go ahead and get over here. Bring her to this side. That's how this works, right? Get over here. Get out of the water, please. That was really close. And if we can just bring her back down here. I mean, I don't know why she's not tracking us in the water specifically. Okay. Come on. Come here, girl. Good girl. The only problem that we're having right now is that she's just going to follow us back to square one. So I know there's a way to do this. Like right now she's just going to eat us. We screwed this up too much. Yeah, she's definitely catching us now. Alright. But we got the right idea. Maybe. So she resets to the left, and then she kind of pulls up wherever you are. So if we can get her to start from over there, that'd be ideal. Because what I was thinking of doing was trying to dive in the water then get her back up here. Like, can we get our toes in the water a little bit? Do like get all the way down here? There we go. Going fishing. All right. Sometimes the simplest solutions are just that, simple and effective. That should give us the clearing that we need. Should. Let's give it a shot. Don't suck at swimming. Don't suck at swimming, please. All right, mermaid. Siren, whatever you call yourself. Mer people. All right, so we don't have things trying to just explode us if we stand out in the open, right? I think this is as good of a point as any to call this episode. Oh, man. That is not... Not what I thought I'd go into. I'm just like, let's just do one more play session right now. But uh, thanks for watching. This is Asher. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, inside, it's still out there on Steam. It's out on Xbox. I think it's out on PS4 as well. Take a look. Feel free to leave your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again next time. Take care.